The wealth of ancient Egypt came from trading food and cotton. That of India came from spices and tea. China's came from silk. Gold brought the Europeans to the Americas. Today, cities like Dubai exist in the desert because of oil. Some of these natural resources have created great wealth and provoked great wars all over the world. Unfortunately, the resources that make the most money these days are non-renewables, like metals and fossil fuels. These are the remains of plants and animals that died millions of years ago, decomposed and were trapped under layers of rock and soil. They produce enormous amounts of energy for heating and cooking, producing electricity and transport. They are also vital ingredients for making plastics and paints. Unfortunately, they have a number of drawbacks. First, they are the greatest cause of pollution on the planet. And second, they are non-renewable, which means we cannot reuse or replace what we use. The good news is that we are developing new technologies and finding new sources of energy to replace them. These include hydroelectric, solar, biofuels and aeolic or wind power. The origin of these resources lies in our natural environment and ecosystems, which replenish over time, thus making them a sustainable and eco-friendly solution to the global energy demands. Gradually, we are making cars and machines that are much more efficient and therefore use much less energy. But you can also help by switching off lights and machines when you leave a room and reducing how much you use heaters or air conditioning. We can also encourage our friends and family to use efficient light bulbs and walk or cycle instead of using cars. Not only do we consume enormous amounts of resources, we also produce huge quantities of waste. Most of this has traditionally been thrown into rivers or taken to landfill sites called dumps. This can cause problems with diseases, pollution and even contributes to global warming with the production of methane and other gases. However, the technology exists for recycling almost every material we use, including glass, metals, paper, plastics, clothes and machines like cell phones. Even leftover food and sewage can be turned into compost or biofuels. By recycling waste, we save money on the exploration and processing of new materials. We reduce deforestation and contamination and we even create jobs for people in the new recycling industry. So the best thing that you can do for yourself and for the planet is to find all the ways you can to reduce, reuse and recycle and to encourage others to do the same.